dangerous mountain passes, death-defying wilderness trails, and deadly wildlife. Here are the top 15 most dangerous places to walk. Number 15. El Caminito del Rey El Caminito del Rey is a terrifying and dangerous pathway that is placed against a steep wall of a narrow canyon in Malaga, Spain. It translates to English as the King's Little Path, and while the path may be little, it takes a lot of boldness to walk. Just looking at images of the walkway can turn your stomach. One wrong move and you'll plummet 100 meters into the rocks and water below. Deemed the world's most dangerous walking path, multiple people have died trying to walk El Caminito del Rey. Still, it continues to attract thrill seekers from all over the world. Number 14. Snake Island Ilha de Camada Grande, also known simply as Snake Island, is a small island located off the Brazilian coast. While the island falls under the jurisdiction of the state of Sao Paulo, there aren't actually any people living on it. And there's a good reason for that. The island is the home of the critically endangered species known as the Golden Lancehead Pit Viper. The island is now infested with these pit vipers, which are highly venomous and capable of easily killing adult humans. Take a walk through the forests on this island, and you probably won't be returning. Number 13. Fukushima Occurring on March 11, 2011, the Fukushima Daiichi event was one of the world's most severe nuclear accidents in history, surpassed only by the Chernobyl disaster of 1986. Along with the Chernobyl disaster, Fukushima is one of only two events to be rated a level 7 nuclear disaster, the worst possible rating. The event was the result of the 2011 Tohoku earthquake and tsunami, and required the evacuation of more than 150,000 people. Because of the nuclear radiation, the site remains the most radioactive place in the world, even years after the explosion. Number 12. Angel's Landing If you're an experienced hiker and have great stamina, the Angel's Landing hiking trail might be the perfect way for you to get an adrenaline rush. If not, then you might want to stay away, because this hike is not for the faint of heart. The trail is 5 miles long and is located on a 1,400-foot-tall rock formation in Zion National Park in Utah. The trail was carved into the enormous rock in 1926 and leads all the way to its peak, where those brave enough to make it are rewarded with a stunning view of Zion Canyon. Although it was opened nearly 100 years ago, there wasn't even a balancing chain installed until recently. Angel's Landing doesn't just look scary, it is one of the deadliest hiking trails in the country. Since 2004, at least 10 people have fallen to their deaths trying to conquer the trail. Number 11. Miyakejima Miyakejima, also called Miyake Island, is an island found in the Izu Archipelago in the Philippine Sea, just over 100 miles off the southeastern coast of Japan. And while there are about 2,500 people still living on the island, its very existence makes it a potentially deadly place to travel to. The entire island is actually a massive, active volcano. The volcano is known to have erupted frequently throughout history and has been recorded erupting as far back as over a thousand years ago. During the 1900s, volcanic eruptions and lava flow killed multiple people on the island. In the year 2000, the island began erupting multiple times and the island's residents had to be evacuated. They weren't able to return to their homes until four years later. After their return, residents were required to wear gas masks due to toxic gases released by the volcano. Number 10. Death Valley Located in the northern Mojave Desert in California and adjacent to the Great Basin Desert is one of the world's most dangerous places to be out by yourself if you're unprepared. Death Valley is a dry desert valley that is infamous in the United States as a somewhat mysterious tourist attraction. Aside from having an eerie name, the area is one of the hottest places in the world. The lowest point in the valley, known as Badwater Basin, is the lowest point in terms of elevation in all of North America, located 282 feet below sea level. Strangely, Badwater Basin is located 84 miles from Mount Whitney, which is the highest point of elevation in the United States. In July of 1913, the United States government measured a temperature of 134 degrees Fahrenheit at Furnace Creek in Death Valley, which remains the highest natural air temperature ever recorded on Earth's surface. Left out here alone or unprepared, your chances of not having a heat stroke are slim. Number 9. Cinnabung Volcano The Cinnabung Volcano, known officially as Mount Cinnabung, is a giant volcano located in northern Sumatra in Indonesia, just 25 miles away from the Lake Toba supervolcano. 
The volcano is infamous among wilderness enthusiasts, anthropologists, and geologists alike for having an unusual and sometimes deadly eruption pattern. Because of this, walking anywhere near this unpredictable volcano might not be the greatest idea. Mount Sinabung is among 120 or so active volcanoes in Indonesia and is part of a group of volcanoes and moving fault lines known as the Pacific Ring of Fire. Before 2010, Mount Sinabung had been inactive for 1,200 years, but suddenly erupted again at the turn of the decade. Since 2010, it's been erupting periodically. In May 2016, a pyroclastic flow from the volcano resulted in the deaths of seven people. In 2014, the volcano killed 16 people. Since 2015, more than 10,000 people have had to flee their homes due to lava, rocks, and dangerous gases being released from the mountain. We are constantly adding more people to the Top 5's production team to bring you all the best content. Be sure to subscribe with notifications on and hit the like button. Number 8. Ramri Island Located off the coast of Rakhine State in the Southeast Asian country of Myanmar is a place known as Ramri Island. With a land area of over 500 square miles, it is the largest island in the country. But Ramri Island has another distinction, and this one might make you want to avoid wandering around. Ramri Island is the home of thousands of hungry saltwater crocodiles. These ones in particular are well known for being extremely aggressive and have been known to hunt and attack people who enter their natural environment. According to the Guinness Book of World Records, the Ramri Island crocodiles hold the record for the highest number of fatalities during a crocodile attack. Saltwater crocodiles are the largest reptilian predators in the world and can weigh over 2,000 pounds. Wander too close to a hungry or agitated croc and you'll definitely be at its mercy, especially if it gets you into the water. Number 7. Mount Everest If there is a world record for being at the top of the most bucket lists, it's got to be the trip up the tallest mountain in the world. The challenge attracts about 800 bold travelers every year. From climbers to hikers to nature enthusiasts, Mount Everest is the ultimate trophy for those who enjoy a physical challenge. But the walk up this 29,000-foot tall mountain is one of the most difficult and deadly hikes in the world. Mount Everest has two primary ways of traveling up its snowy cliffs. The most common route approaches the legendary mountain from Nepal in the southeast. There is another popular route, however, that goes up the mountain from Tibet in the north. While climbing the mountain isn't known to be very difficult in terms of climbing techniques and finesse, the raw elements are what makes this trip so dangerous. Mount Everest attempts to stop its climbers every step of the way with strong winds, pelting snowstorms, altitude sickness, and fatal avalanches. Hundreds of people have died trying to climb the mountain. In fact, 6.5% of people trying to reach its peak have died before they got there. Most of their bodies were never recovered. Number 6. Memphis, Tennessee While most of the dangerous places to walk on this list are rocky mountain paths, dangerous islands, or radioactive fallout zones, Memphis doesn't exactly fit in with the rest. Located along the Mississippi River in the southwestern corner of Tennessee, Memphis is a historic and culturally significant American city. Yet for all the accomplishments made by the people of Memphis, it's actually the deadliest place to walk in the United States. What makes this city deadly for pedestrians has nothing to do with environmental disasters or violent crime. Rather, this city is dangerous to walk in because of its traffic. And it's all thanks to a combination of speedy highways, lack of proper infrastructure, and distracted drivers. Each year, an unusually high number of pedestrians are struck and killed by vehicles in Memphis. The city has a pedestrian death rate of about four deaths for every 100,000 people, which is higher than any other city in the country. Seattle, which is three times larger than Memphis, sees less pedestrian deaths each year. Unfortunately, the pedestrian fatality rate in the city is only going up year after year, and if local officials don't figure out a solution soon, Memphis will keep climbing the ranks. Number 5. Husaini Hanging Bridge do you recall those bridges that always appear in adventure films involving wilderness explorers, monster hunters, or treasure seekers? The ones with loose, dangly ropes for side rails and small planks of wood for the pathway. Well, the Husaini Hanging Bridge is kind of like that, only a hundred times scarier, more dangerous, and real. The bridge can be found in northern Pakistan. In today's world, most people take for granted just how easy it is to travel and move around places, but for the people residing in the Gilgit-Baltistan region of Pakistan, 
quick travel was nearly impossible until 1978, as they were cut off from the rest of Pakistan because of the lack of roads and infrastructure. Back then, planes were reserved only for the extremely wealthy. At that time, the only way for people to travel was by crossing rugged and rocky mountain passes. The people built bridges like the Husaini Hanging Bridge for traveling throughout the region. This particular bridge is not only extremely long, but it hasn't been maintained very well over time. It's missing a lot of its planks, and a lot of the planks that remain are splintered. Since the bridge is so long, the wind constantly shakes it around. Number 4. Baltimore Just like Memphis, Baltimore is a historic and culturally significant city in the United States. After all, it is the capital and most populous city in the state of Maryland, which surrounds Washington, D.C. Still, Baltimore is infamous for having an extremely high rate of violent and nonviolent crime. In 2019, Baltimore was recorded as having the highest murder rate of any city in the United States, with nearly 60 murders per 100,000 people, and it's only gotten worse since then. Every year in Baltimore, hundreds of people are murdered, and that's not counting other types of violent crime. With all that said, Baltimore is a beautiful city, and many see it as one of the centers of American history, being located just 40 miles from the nation's capital. It's home to sports teams, numerous historic sites and buildings, as well as a number of prestigious universities. In addition, a number of notable people have originated from Baltimore, including Edgar Allan Poe and Babe Ruth. In the end, Baltimore is a city that has had a lot of great moments, but remains extremely dangerous in some neighborhoods. For anyone deciding to walk around high crime areas of the city alone or at night, be cautious. Number 3. Lake Natron this high-sodium lake is located in the Arusha region of northern Tanzania, a country in East Africa. Lake Natron is considered one of the most tranquil bodies of water in Africa. On the other hand, it's also the site of multiple fascinating photographs of dead, petrified animals. Because of its chemical attributes, Lake Natron is one of the world's strangest and deadliest lakes. Salt crusts can cause the lake to gain reddish hues, giving it an even creepier atmosphere. Despite the lake itself being the direct cause of the species' endangerment, lesser flamingos flock by the hundreds to Lake Natron, one of their primary breeding grounds. During times of the year with very little rainfall, the water levels recede. Islands made out of crystallized salt appear on the water surface, where the flamingos build their nests. Algae from the water feed on these nests, but that's just a minor threat compared to the lake's other mysteries. Lake Natron routinely kills animals with its strange properties. Its chemically dangerous waters give off a clear reflection, causing birds to crash directly into its surface without realizing there's anything there. Reportedly, a helicopter pilot also once crashed into its surface. Animals that die in the lake are turned into perfectly preserved statues through petrification. Even stranger, these animals are petrified in perfect poses, making them look more like statues than corpses. Not only will walking around this place make you extremely depressed, but if you somehow don't inhale the toxins from the lake chemicals, you're definitely going to inhale something from nearby corpses. Number 2. Chernobyl In what was probably the most well-known radioactive disaster in history, the Chernobyl disaster that occurred in April of 1986 was so shocking that the word Chernobyl is now a household word. The nuclear accident occurred on a Saturday at Chernobyl Nuclear Power Plant, just outside the city of Pripyat in Soviet Ukraine. As the worst nuclear disaster to ever occur, the 1986 event at Chernobyl is one of only two nuclear disasters rated at the maximum number of seven on the International Nuclear Event Scale. The event was essentially a massive nuclear explosion caused by a defective reactor being operated on by an underprepared crew. The steam explosion resulted in a fiery blast that released at least 5% of the radioactive reactor core into the atmosphere. The blast from the reactor explosion directly killed two people on site. In the following days, a number of firemen and power plant personnel died from nuclear radiation. Due to the amount of radiation released during the explosion, the area containing the ruins of the Chernobyl power plant is one of the most dangerous places to walk on Earth. The area is now known as the Chernobyl Exclusion Zone and covers about a thousand square miles. The area is quarantined by the government of Ukraine and is basically a giant microwave. Step too close to the power plant itself and you might end up like a villain from a Spider-Man film. Number 1. The Plank Walk One of the world's most dangerous tourist attractions is located on the peak of a mountain, thousands of meters in the air known as the Plank Walk on Mount Hua in Shanxi, China. 
this trail is ranked as the most dangerous hiking route on Earth. Just looking at images of Mount Hua can make your stomach drop. Hikers who come to Mount Hua journey across thin and old planks of wood bolted 7,000 feet in the air to the side of a mountain's southern peak. The terrifyingly high plank walk is a highly popular destination for adventurers and thrill-seekers, those who make it to the peak and experience a serene tea house built from an old Taoist temple. Mount Hua, however, has a long past of spiritual significance. It's one of China's five great mountains, a group of the most renowned mountains in the Chinese traditional religion. Often associated with the five cosmic deities, Mount Hua was the destination of many pilgrimages by emperors throughout history. At the base of Mount Hua, the Shrine of the Western Peak serves as a place of worship for Taoist monks, who believe that the god of the underworld resides in the mountain. Even more mysterious, many people throughout history believe Mount Hua to hold the secret to immortality, as many herbal drugs and medicine have been discovered there. With its breathtaking views, steep climbs, and mysterious legends, Mount Hua is an ideal destination for those daring enough to walk its awe-inspiring paths. Watch our scary playlist for more top 15 videos about the most scary subjects. Sit back, relax, and binge watch all of our best videos.